What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Mr. Lightwork, Lightwork for short. And today, I will be bringing y'all this video in reference to the top rookie QBs from this past draft, their rookie rating. Okay. Now, if you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. Also, hit that bell icon so you know when my videos do drop. But let's jump in. Okay, so yesterday I dropped a video showing the uh, the rookie ratings reveal trailer, basically. So they had Steve Young come in and basically tell each QB their ratings, different ratings and stuff like that. So I'm going to show you all the, the reveal, and then we're going to jump back into it and look at some actual ratings, uh, their full ratings, okay? Steve Young here, buddy. How are you? Hey, what's up? You can see my jacket here. Madden ratings performance adjuster. Hey, this is this is the guy you guys got. So deep throwing, deep throwing accuracy. What do you think? What do you got? Yeah, I'd say for a rookie, uh, I'd say 78, you know? Yeah, know? 81. 81, okay. I'm happy with that. <laughs> All right, speed, speed. 70 something. Yeah, they give you 86. Oh, juke, juke, the ability to have a good face. Oh, that's 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 an easy one. That's going to be about 42. They gave you 72, which I, I'm telling oh. you, there's some Justin Herbert fans at Madden. I'm going to tell you that right now. Big well, time. Find their game every year for the past 20 years. What do you think your play action rating is? Probably like 75. You're going to be happy here, bro. You're going to be okay. very happy. 84. Okay. Right? <laughs> Strength. 80 something. 80 something. Right. You're going to get mad at this one. They give you 72. Oh. It's one of those ones right there. I know, Jalen, you're going to say, you know what? I can bench press that 72 right out of the building. I mean, all the college that's when I did, all the, you know. How about throwing the run? Throwing the run, I'd have to say maybe uh, 82. Yeah, I would too. 81. I would have I would have given you 85. I argue for 85, but... Uh, I mean, it's tough it for rookies. Break a sack. 50? You're the best. You're the best. It's 80. Oh, it's 80? Oh, okay. Two. Not that bad. They're not that not bad. Right. Right now, how many tackles have you made in your college career? Do you know? I don't think I've ever missed a, missed a tackle. They gave you a 37. Ooh. Hopefully, I don't got to tackle that many times. <laughs> yeah, right? All right, what do you think overall? I'm going to go with uh, 81. 71. Dang. <laughs> like, I have to think you would say, like, you know what? Screw that. I'm better than everybody. <laughs> so what do y'all think, man? I think it was pretty cool, like I said, having Steve Young reveal some of their uh, their overalls or their ratings and different things like that. So I think that was really dope for a Hall of Famer to bring up the next generation in reference to Madden. But we're going to jump into the actual ratings, their actual ratings, and then we're just going to talk about it. So Joe Burrow obviously is the better, the best QB for the rookies in the game because he was drafted in one overall, Heisman winner, all the trophies, all the accolades, national champion. But let's look a couple, let's look at a couple of these. So um, you got Tua, Jordan Love, Justin Herbert, Jalen Hurts, Jacob Eason, and Jake Fromm. Now, these are the top, I want to say the top seven. The top seven quarterbacks that were taken in the draft. Uh, I I don't disagree with anything. I do think um, throw power, Jacob Eason and Jordan Love do have the throw power. So, they will be some somebody to actually play with that can get the ball out there. I don't I don't look at their um, ratings as as bad as like they are in previous Maddens because you know they always uh, do the rookies bad, but I really do like what I'm seeing from the top seven guys, the top seven QBs that were taken in the draft. Now, yeah, you can go back and and see all the QBs drafted, but we only care about select few. Um, so yeah, man, like what what do y'all what do y'all think about this? Now I'm going to show y'all the next screenshot. That's their throwing accuracy, different things like that. That's what sets them apart. 
now I'm not gonna spend too much time on this screen or this screenshot because y'all can read it for yourselves but if you do not know SAC is short throwing accuracy um, MAC is middle throwing accuracy and DAC is deep throwing accuracy and then PAC is play action okay so I feel that Tua does have the better play action you know I don't see too many discrepancies probably you know little things here and there so it's not a big deal to me but y'all need to check the ratings before you pick these teams with these rookies so what do y'all think man like I'm not gonna front man I'm excited because this year they didn't screw the rookies like I thought they were gonna do you know I, every year they you know kind of make them 60 or 65s or 70s low 70s this year even though they're low 70s you know they still have pretty good ratings if y'all understand what i'm saying like even though the overall is trash because your overall goes through everything it's not just your throw power or whatever because if it was just that a lot of these guys would be 80 overall 85s 85 overall all right or high 70s so yeah man i just want to bring y'all this quick video um hold on hold on wait 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 we got, I got another announcement. I got another announcement. Just just sit there. All right. Anything you want to say to them about ratings? Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. So, look. Just stay back on the mark. Uh, nah, hold on. I want to get up and personal about this. And a big hit. And oh, what a catch. What do I think my ratings would be? Speed, strength, awareness. 99 Club? Yeah. And League Nation? Yeah. Myself? Top five rated guys on my team, obviously me. I should be in the 90s somewhere. I need my X Factor back. Y'all sleeping, man. Yeah, that's it, bro. I'm on my, I'm done for my rant. I feel so much better that I got that out. So, on July 13th through the 17th, they will be revealing everybody's ratings in Man 21. All right, now you saw in the trailer they had Lamar Jackson, Mark Ingram, Alvin Kamara, Zeke, you know, Keenan Allen. You know, they had all these guys basically saying, like, yo, my rating should be high or I should be in the 90s. I should have my X Factor back. You know, things that EA seems to drop the ball on a lot and, and they get pissed about it. So, because, um, you know, they love to play Madden too. Um, but. If they feel that they're being cheated, they probably won't play it like the guy, like the running back from the Lions. He doesn't play Madden because of the overalls and he don't agree with what they uh, do. But it is what it is. Um, Lamar Jackson said he's supposed to be a part of the 99 club. Now, what do y'all think? You know what I'm saying? For myself, I think he should be a, like a high 97, maybe even 98. Um, just because of what he did as an MVP. But um, right now, as we know, Pat Mahomes is in the 99 club. I don't know if they're going to do four or maybe five people this time. Uh, I think l last year they did four, and um, which was pretty cool, pretty dope. But um, let's see how many they do this year. All right. Now, that's the end of the video, guys. I just wanted to kind of throw these things in there, uh, show you these ratings. Uh, do you agree with them? Do you not agree with them? And everything like that so leave in the comment section who do you think will be in the 99 overall club will it be you know lamar pat mahomes would it be some running back or would it be some cornerback linebacker db whatever whatever it is you know what i'm saying whoever y'all think should be in the 99 club leave it in the comment section thank y'all so much for watching this video thank you just man from the bottom of my heart thank you so much to all my new subscribers thank you thank you for joining the family and the movement and at the end of the day when you do the work you see the light man it's your boy light work make sure y'all subscribe to the channel and we go peace